Hey guys, Alicia from Love Letter Generation. Thought I'd jump on and just show you a couple of projects that I've been working on lately. I've basically been using up all my Maggie Holmes supplies because I love them so much. And um, I created a carousel um, themed tag flip and a gorgeous um, flourish pocket letter, which I'll show you in a sec. So I'll start with the tag flip first. Okay, so with the tag flip, I used a couple of the um, the carousel tickets. They're kind of like the little embellishment pieces and the cutter parts that you can get in the collection. And I thought they'd be a cute um, element to the tag flip. And I love how colourful and bright this one turned out. This um, giraffe tag was one I did a while ago with another tag flip. And then I think I recall saying in my last video that I basically pulled one sort of small tag flip that I did and I created two bigger tag flips. So this was one of the pieces basically that I pulled from one of my older ones that I did that, you know, I sort of kept on my wall and thought, nah, I'm going to going to use it. And I pulled it apart and now everything's basically um, like themed and goes well together. So we've got this little tag here. It's pretty cute. I thought I'd add in these um, these number ephemera pieces that you get in the ephemera pack just for something different as well. And you can break them apart and and reuse all of these things basically that I'm um, that I'm sending. I loved how this one um, turned out. So this zebra wasn't from the carousel ephemera pack it was actually from a um an aliexpress ephemera pack that i found that kind of have has you know um ones that are sort of similar looking to to maggie holmes so i popped one of the tickets sort of down in the background and um so all the you know all the colors didn't blend in together and then on the back of the zebra, I popped some foam tape to give it that um, that sort of 3D, um, you know, look there. Um, this one, I thought it'd be cute. This is from the carousel collection as well. It's like the acetate bit and it has gold pieces of like sparkly glitter, glitter through it, which you can see there. And I thought that would, that would look really nice. Um, you know, sort of over the top of all these tags, being able to sort of see through it. Um, this one I sort of kept a little bit simple, but I love this cut apart. I find it so cute and pretty um, with the carousel horses. So I basically popped down a word sticker, a couple of um, chipboard stickers from the carousel collection, and this is one of the um, the paper clips, which is also carousel. Um, this tag here, again, um, the tag was actually from the ephemera pack, and then using one of the AliExpress um, ephemera packs, I popped down this um, this little carousel horse, which is really pretty. And then I've just got like a word sticker and enamel dot on there. Um, this one I sort of kept a bit simple. Um, I placed down a flag, or it's not a flag, sorry, a kite, a kite ephemera piece. And then on um, foam tape, I propped up this um, cut apart here. This one was a cut apart as well that I just um, trimmed down and I thought because it's so bright and colourful, I didn't need to do anything else to it, you know what I mean? It's, it's quite nice as it is. 
Um, this one, I did a, the sort of same sort of thing, but I popped down, I cut apart, placed down um, one of the chipboard stickers and a few enamel dots, but I sort of put it sort of on an angle. So, it, you know, it gives the tag a sort of different look to it. This one here was done with my sewing machine. Um, so I basically popped down one of the carousel ephemera pieces, which is the ticket lady that you can see in there. Um, I made up a sequin mix and then using some pretty gold tool um, that I received from one of my pen pals, I, um, I stitched it down. Um, all around the edges to make it into a sequin shaker and then I decided with the ephemera piece um, to also sew that down as well so I'm quite happy with with how that one turned out um, next one is all sort of um, giraffes so I basically popped down the cut apart, giraffe cut apart, the giraffe ephemera piece, and this is one of the chipboard stickers, and then just a couple of enamel dots. So I thought that turned out fairly cute and colourful and bright, and you know, I love the sort of circus theme. It's very, um, very cute. So like this should make anyone happy, you know, receiving sort of fair type themed mail. So next I have the pocket letter which I made last night because it's um it's been really gloomy and horrible here in in Victoria at the moment. Like we've sort of been getting um like the global warming's getting us I reckon basically. So with this one I used, um, I basically recycled um, an old sort of um, pocket letter. So I, I emptied it completely and then I've just done it up myself with, you know, my own style. So I was basically only using the, the pocket, um, I don't know what you call these. Um, Project Life pockets or something, I'm not too sure. Um, but I can't actually get the small ones like this. I don't know where you get them from. All of mine are actually really big sort of um, pockets. So, and I usually have to cut a strip off to make it a bit smaller because they end up being like this big, basically. So. Um, with this one, I just placed down some um, washi tape down the side. I always do it, you know, on, on the back and the front. And then I punched a hole just here to hang this little um, little tassel. And then just pop this little paper clip there because I thought that was cute. The gold glitter star. Um, on this one, all I did was with my, um, is it six by eight flourish paper pad, I just cut them all down to the size of the pockets that I wanted. And I sort of went with a, a color theme of basically um, pinks and yellows, because I thought that was, that was a really pretty um, color combo. And it's all very sort of floral, like every piece of paper basically has florals on it. So um, this was out of the ephemera pack, the Flourish ephemera pack, and I've popped it onto some um, foam tape to stick that down. Um, then with the embellishments, I've stuck down the butterfly. Um, I added a couple of the little um, stickers from the Flourish sticker pack. And this giant piece I thought would look good sort of hanging over the way I've done it there um, and that's just like the ephemera piece out of the flourish pack as well and I stuck one of the little beetles on it because 
you know, you usually find beetles crawling all over your strawberry plants. So, um, this one here is just one of the embellishment, um, out of the embellishment pack. And then one of the word stickers. Then I've got the, is it the quail or a pheasant? I'm pretty sure it might be a quail. I'm, I'm not too sure. Don't quote me on that. <laughs> um, and it's like the puffy sticker. It's really cute. And then I just stuck one of the bugs there. So it's like the quails looking at the, you know, the beetle crawling across the, across the page there. And a word sticker. Um, this one I sort of kept a bit simple with just the little houses and sort of different dimensions as well. So I've got like the the flat sticker from the sticker sheet and then I've popped down the um, the chipboard sticker which is, you know, a lot thicker. So you've got two different sort of dimensions there. Um, this one here I just popped down... Um, the floral ephemera piece and then I propped up this um, sold cut apart onto some foam tape. This one here is the chipboard piece, um, a sticker from the sticker pack and a couple of enamel dots. So the enamel dots that I used on this um, pocket letter, they aren't uh, from Flourish because they don't do an enamel dots, but I think they should, like, um, they'd be really pretty if they did, like, f enamel dots that matched the colour of the collection, like, that would be cute. Because a lot of people like enamel dots, like, they're just a good little element to add to your mail. Um, this pocket here was sort of already full of, like, a cute little sequin mix, so... I thought I'd just add this cute little squirrel to it and this um, word sticker and then I just um, stuck down this pretty bit of um, bit of trim here. So yeah, I'm very happy with how this one turned out. I think it's probably one of my best pocket letters, you know, that I've made in a long time. So. It just was, you know, it, it worked really well for me. Like it was sort of e easy, I guess you could say, for me. Like I didn't really have to think a lot about it, whereas usually I do. It was just, yeah, it all just came to me. So, yeah, I'm very happy with it. And I think it helps too when, when you have a good collection that you're working with and it just all goes together really well. So, yeah, I thought I'd show you guys. Sorry, I haven't had any mail to show you. I haven't sort of received any for a while. So I've just been making and sending heaps out. So I thought I'd show you my little projects of what I've been making. And, yeah, I've been been enjoying it and, and having fun and crafting and on these, you know, wet, gloomy days. Today's a lot nicer, but that's good because that means I get this great lighting to um to show you guys these these videos. So I'll just pop that up a bit so you can see see it better all in the one. But um yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Leave me a comment, subscribe if you haven't already. Um, hit the like button. And I'll talk to you guys all again soon. Bye.